A loved ones are mourning the death of a 17 year old from Marin County. The young man drowned Monday evening while boating at Lake Tahoe with friends. KW's Ann Rubin joins us now live and and authorities are calling this really just a, a tragic accident. Yeah, authorities are still investigating, but it appears that Kawashima was simply knocked off balance and into the water when the boat hit a wave. Those that knew 17 year old Miles Kawashima say he was two things, a standout athlete and a great friend. Genuinely a good guy who wanted to see people happy and successful. Nick Nadane coached him in JV football for two years at Redwood High School in Larkspur. He says he'll remember Kawashima's heart and his integrity. You stand for the, the right side of things. You try to be good to people, kind to people, you know, and help people in any way that you can. And that was, that was Miles. Miles was that kid. But Monday night, his life was cut short while boating on Lake Tahoe with friends. Apparently, uh, he, all he was trying to do was move to another seat on the boat while it was underway. And they hit a wave and he was ejected from the boat. Authorities say they're investigating what happened next, whether the impact or the shock of cold water were factors. But they say Kawashima was not wearing a life vest. He apparently started to struggle pretty quickly because his friends turned around and by the time they got back to where he was, he had already gone under the water. His friends got him out and authorities performed CPR, but it was too late. Kawashima died on the way to the hospital. The medical examiner's office says the official cause of death is drowning. It couldn't be more simple. And now, you know, here we are with families destroyed and, and friends. Like, the, the, it's really a tragic story. Kawashima also played baseball for the California Warriors. His coach released a statement saying, Miles was a team first kid, humble and hardworking. He never complained. And whenever he stepped out on the mound, he gave it his all. Coach Nodane says he couldn't agree more. He was a stand up kid, man. That was a stand up guy. Nevada officials say that while the law does not require those over age 12 to wear a life vest, it does require people to have them on the boat. However, they say in this case, it might have meant the difference between life and death had he been wearing one. Heather? Yeah, just, just a tragic story and yet, and yet another reminder of the dangers that arise during the summertime. All right, Ann Rubin reporting live for us today. Thank you, Ann.